I may never, ever go back to Paris and here's why. So this might just be my experience, I don't know. I don't know. Anyway, I'm walking down the street in Paris. I'm holding my partner's hand, ex-partner now, by the way, walking down the street. And then a man just stares at me like, this is the first time I've ever been stared at in Paris, okay? So I'm like, oh, maybe they're just looking at my tattoos and that. Maybe they don't have many tattooed people here. It's full on staring. And then goes, I'm like, what? You, you're looking at me. So, oh, yes, yes, sir. I'll leave my partner and I'll come with you. And I stayed for about three days and every day this happened, no joke, I'm not the most beautifulest person on the world. So why on earth are they picking on me? I don't know. Anyway, or is it just Paris? Because it's never happened anywhere else in the world that I've been to. So then I'm walking along the street and I'm like, oh, isn't this lovely? Um, and I'm looking around and everything's nice and clean and perfect. And then there's just a massive bin and the bin's got things piled on top of it. And I'm like, this is going to topple on top of me. Is this like all of Paris's junk in one place? What is going on? And then I walk further along and there's homeless people lying on the floor. Literally got their nose on the floor. Like begging like this. And I've never seen that in the UK. And all the beggars in Paris were missing legs and arms. And I'm like, what? The homeless people in the UK don't miss legs and arms and whatever else. So what's going on here? And then you walk further along and you go to the Eiffel Tower. Now, when you get to the Eiffel Tower, there's like millions of scam artists underneath the Eiffel Tower. And obviously, like, I'm the one to fall for it. I'm, people like me are the people that fall for it. And a little child's like, hello, can you please help the children? And she's holding a scabby bit of cardboard and a scabby piece of paper on top. And she's like, I just need some bank details. I'm like, oh, of course, I'll help the children. Ex-partner pulls the pen out of my hand and he's like, no, we're not doing that. And we walk off. And I'm like... I nearly got scammed by some child on the street. So please comment below if you think if this has ever happened to you because I just need to know if I'm the only one. <laughs>